let me reintroduce you guys to Little Scrappy. Those that have never seen this car, I will say it's a situation of, if you don't know, now you know. This is a 66 Mustang. It has a military scheme going with it. Here the exhaust. It was built by my man Phil over at Find Em and Flip Em. So this is not my original design. I'm just gonna make it more better. So as well damn, what's under the hood? It's dirty because it's been in the paint shop for quite some time. So I guess it's time to reintroduce it and let everybody see what's coming next from Money Stereo Installation, the Rebirth of Little Scrappy, coming soon. The previous owner was in an accident. I got the quarter panel replaced. It's been in the uh, paint shop for over a year. Had a few mishaps along the way, dealing with certain people. And so I took it to my guys who been pretty consistent with my stuff down here. I went out of my normal comfort zone, talked to some new people. It didn't go quite right. He did do the quarter panel work. He did fix all the little flaws that were on it. But the execution of the job was no bueno, no good. So I got it down to my man, Nicholas and he gonna get me out. So, coming to a street near you for the summer, or if not sooner, a little scrappy. The remix! That's all I got to say. Hey Phil, this is what I was talking about. See how much play I got? And no wheel movement? You think it's in the power steering or the center link? I mean, in the center link or in the, um, the manual steering box? What'd you think? Crashing out to my people, my Mustang man. Yeah, that part, too much play. Gotta tighten that up. Yeah, we are um, gonna wait for the guy to come for the um, interior because um, we have to um, fix a few things. He, um, wet sand and buff the doors a little better because they weren't quite the same finish as the rest of it. One thing I forgot to um, tell him about was the pieces of the upholstery near the bottom. So he's gonna um, redo that. The headliner, it's acceptable. And so, um, yeah. But I forgot to tell him about the part for the um for the lower half so which is right here so they're gonna add that on to it make it happen over here at the body shop you know they got all kinds of stuff going on they spraying somebody on the uh up in the air Monte Carlo, BMW, the old school frame machine. If you know what that is, if you don't know, you better ask somebody. So these guys are always staying busy, keeping busy, doing things, you know. Um, I just talked to him about doing some extra work over here. And so they're going to um, 
fix a few things on the truck too. So they're gonna um, repaint my front bumper and fix the rear bumper on this and buff the truck out. So I've gotten here at like nine this morning. And so we're gonna um, see what we can do. So I'm down here talking with my man Juan at Economical Auto Body Shop in Tijuana. That's the correct, that's the number right there to get to you right there, Juan? Okay, and the best way to get to Juan is What's up app. You can send your pictures or inquiries to him and he can give you an ideal of what it's gonna cost to do the work. Now he's not gonna give you exact numbers because he has not seen the project, but this is how you can reach out to him. I'm not gonna state my prices because it's I have different things going, but he is the person that's looking for right here in beautiful downtown Tijuana. Easy to get to. If we were on top of the building, you can see America. He sends picture, he's a good person to talk to, he can make it happen for you. Yeah. I'm just letting you guys know. Yeah. We're out of here. Gotta go. So they're putting the final touches on it. You know, just to make sure things are where they need to be. You know. But yeah, he's looking pretty good. Much better than the first go around. Yeah. You, okay, I'm down here at, what's the body shop you represent? 101, 101 that's the name of your body shop? Are, are you with Economical? Yeah. Okay, with Economical. As Soon as you guys come into TJ, you follow the loop how I came in before. As Soon as you come around the loop and you come through that, where these cars are coming from right here, this is the man you're gonna see right here. And you're gonna be like, hey, come on in. He's with Nicholas, and so if you, Flag into, he flags you in to talk to him, he's with Economical. Economical has this area here and down the block. And so if your car's not in that shop, it'll be sitting over here. So this is the guy, he'll be out here, the first contact guy right here. What's your name, my man? Roman. Roman will be here for you. So if you see him, he's a good guy to talk to. That's all I got to say. Gotta go. So we're turning in, we thought it was gonna be a turn and burn day. I got my the wet sanding the work truck and putting a new buff on him. You see, they've hit all that. And he's like, ooh wee, as you see. Oh, looking good. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So they're gonna reach out and touch me, to get me more better, most definitely. So let's walk up the street next, and we're gonna see my friend uh, Nicholas up the street and see what progress he's made on the cars that we have up the street. So, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna be here all day. You see, the other body shops on the same block, I just haven't dealt with these guys yet, so I don't know what they're capable. I see all kind of um, work that they put out of here. So, English, my friend? English? How much do you, for this kind of car right here, for this type of paint job, I see you fixing the uh, the, the metal work. How much is something like this costing? The paint, the paint is good. The car right there, you put in uh, a new piece of metal. Uh huh. But around this kind of body, right? Uh huh. Yes, he fixes it right here, right there. He, yeah, rebuild the whole yeah, ledge, yeah. He put a new one. What, what color are you going to paint it? Same color. Same color? Okay. So, because you see, I, I'm next door with, with yeah. Juan, and I'd be up, I mean, with Juan, and I'm up the street with Nicholas, but I haven't tried the other body shops, and a lot of my friends are asking me, well, Robert, what do they charge? You know, or what kind of work is everybody doing? And so I said, well, I'm going to do an interview and show people what I see. I see you got Porsches and stuff. Yeah. So, this porch. Uh huh. This, this porch, he fits inside to put a new paint. Uh huh. Uh huh. He put a new pizza. Oh, a new pan he in. Make it. He make it. They kind of machine right there for making pizzas. Oh, okay. Yeah. Fabricating. Okay. Yeah. Right here. Uh huh. Paint it the model four side door. Oh, four side door. And uh, and body work. Uh huh. And paint. Okay. I I know the question I'm about to ask cannot be a definite number because everybody you have to see mm -hmm. their car to tell them. But for a situation like this right here. What is a roundabout price something like this will cost but to the, get the done? The price, 
the price it varies from how much work. Like, like the kind of wood you want. Yeah, the kind it's of like wood. Right, right here, right, right there. If you keep pizza around, yeah. If you cut the pizza right there, you put a new pizza. Yeah, yeah. I'll show you. Okay. Oh yeah, you you Yeah, in the whole cut, he be like that. Okay, okay. Cut it, he put a little piece. Yeah, cut the piece. Right here, he cut it, he pop it up, he put it back. Okay, okay. Because no got wrong, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. That's that's why I'm saying I, a lot of my friends are asking me what do they charge, and so I'm not asking you for an exact number for a person's car you have never uh -huh. seen. But my question is like, for example, I see what you are doing here. How much does this job cost you? Okay, right here. Yeah. For measure work. Yeah. Fourteen hundred. Fourteen hundred. Yeah. And that's with the metal you did in the back. Yeah, yeah, the metal right there. Uh -huh. You know, piece of right there. And good, uh, good quality paint job, wet sand uh, clear. Or, paint, paint, uh -huh. commercial paint, but uh, paint is good anyway. Okay. The pond got three different kinds of paint. Oh, okay. Up, middle, and lower. So but it's, it's good. So this one is going to be the middle, the lower, which one no, is No, this, this one? is one of, uh, the, middle, the middle. It's going to be the yeah, middle. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if he went with the, the best one you can do, would that would be the wet sand buff and everything like that? Yeah, yeah. This, this guy painted it uh, and buff it. Okay. okay. But no, no, not a body work. No oh. holes. Oh, no, no holes. Okay. No holes. You might do it cheaper. Okay. Because no it, it wasn't a whole lot of stuff you had to do yeah, to it. Yeah, holes and, and cut it for a little piece of, you know, of the price. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay, your name is Miguel. Miguel, yeah. how can people get to you? What number do they can use to talk to you? If someone wants to call you or WhatsApp, send you pictures of their car, do you have a yeah. number? Yeah, no, no. In the internet, I got to beat you. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so what page okay. can they get to you at? Yeah, this is my phone number. This is my phone number. You, you can call me right there. Okay, okay. All right. You can have it. Okay, for sure. So if someone wants to contact you, they can reach you through here, and they can call you maybe. I'll show you another, another stop, another car, uh -huh. and I make the parts. Come on. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm right here with you. Fiberglass work. Yeah. This car, the horn is really no part. Uh -huh. He made that part, but he make it up part. Oh, okay. So you build a whole. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Right there, he cut it. Uh huh. Pop it out, put it back. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay. He make the part. Oh. Make the part. So you guys make the parts. Yeah, nobody do it right here like that. Oh, okay. He has a machine right there. Oh, okay, okay. Yes, so you can bend it. It bends it and make, make it. it. Okay, okay. Somebody cut it and it leaves the right here for no piece of part. Ah. Make the part. So okay. Make it. Okay. It's in a different. Okay, for sure. Well, here you guys, this is the card right here. Take a screenshot of that. And yeah. this is how you can get to him. He's right next door to, to um, Juan. And so I'm going to walk down the block and show everybody. So you can pick and choose who you want to deal with. I'm letting you see their work. Okay. So maybe you guys can come and see. A lot of people like to do it in the old car like that. Okay. Car it or a little piece of it. Okay, yeah. That's very good, my friend. Thank you. Thank you very much. I, thank you for your time to show me what you got. What's your name? Robert. Robert. Okay. Yeah. Okay.